So, and uh, 2023's been uh, was a fabulous year, um, but uh, it's, it's already been uh, a wonderful 2024 because um, uh, if we think back to a few weeks ago, Pro Wrestling Eve, and uh, when I introduced you, I was a little bit confused about how to introduce you, and I kind of nearly stumbled <laughs> over my words a little bit, and of course I introduced you as Nightshade, but I could have introduced you as Lampshade, <laughs> because... Uh, well, As many of our viewers may know, you you won the uh, the Pro Wrestling Eve Multiverse Rumble. I think it was early January, maybe the fourth or the fifth. Um, was, and you're yeah. your alter ego now. Multiverse Rumbles are always great fun. You never know quite what you're going to get. Um, but I never quite expected to see Nightshade as Lampshade. Tell us about it. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm actually wearing my lampshade t-shirt today. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> so I thought almost every single interview I wear my nightshade, but I thought, you know what, as it's so soon since the multiverse, I thought I would actually wear the lampshade t-shirt and be seen in it. <laughs> um, so for years now, people have chanted at me lampshade instead of chanting nightshade to have a little dig at me you know as a villain you you expect some sort of funny chance but lampshade is never one of them that i could have imagined um so i decided to bring lampshade to life finally once and for all and there's no better place to do it than in the pressing eve multiverse rumble and somehow she made it all the way through to the end, entered third, <laughs> went through to the end and, and won it, even though I couldn't see under my lampshade. Well, this so is it. I'm going to bring up the picture again. And I've seen clips of that match. I've seen <laughs> clips of you in the Rumble. I'm amazed you were even able to get into the ring, let alone win the whole thing. I, how awkward was it to kind of have that thing on your head? And of course, it's illuminated as well. So you're probably blinded as well as uh, not having great vision anyway. Uh, what was it like to perform in? I literally could not see a thing. Like, tr truly could not see anything. Um, so I think the fans that were there at the time, as the seats were quite low in comparison to the ring, I think they could see a lot more of me than I could see in general. So I think they were probably under the assumption that I could see a lot more than I could, but now I literally could hardly see anything. But thankfully, Lampshade is an inanimate object. So, you know, I only really came to life here and there and uh, everyone ended up leaving me alone and not attempting to eliminate me. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. But uh, it started off your 2024 um, you know, in great fashion. Of course, a little, here's a little picture of some of the characters there. I think we had Mario, Luigi, The Mask, oh. and one or two others. Um, and of course, Lanch. you mentioned your T-shirt. And of course, I'm going to talk about your merch a bit later. But uh, it is available currently on your big cartel. Um, so uh, uh, I'll, I'll just bring up the little ticker now because you can go to uh, Nightshade's big cartel um, and uh, we'll give it a full plug later on. I'm just waiting for it to kind of scroll along there. But uh, do you know your big cartel off the top of your head, Nightshade? I do, I believe it's nightshadewrestler.bigcartel.com. There we go, there we go. But so we'll talk more about your merch later. But that very t shirt the nightshade is wearing is available on her big cartel already. It is. And, and I do uh, have a lamp on my head, just <laughs> like in the multiverse. <laughs> but but you don't plan on uh, kind of expanding that gimmick into other promotions, do you? Or is it just a one off? Or maybe we'll see it in next year's multiverse rumble. Um, any plans yeah. to kind of bring it back, maybe? Honestly, I Maybe think some just have, to see, have to see where Lampshade goes. You know, she's got an undefeated streak currently. So she, 